So, hang on, she wants you to give her the money so that Robert can buy the bistro from Nick? Yes. <laughs> Just saying it out loud doesn't help me raise ten grand, does it? Well, tell her to get lost. Shell, I love Nick. And in a couple of months, we could be well away from here and Tracy could have what she wants and I could have Nick. That's well worth ten grand, isn't it? Yes, except you don't have the money. Well, you're going to have to eat something. I can't. I promise. I mean it, OK? I'll sort it. Any questions, call me. 24-7. You sure about that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and after ten, you get transferred to a call centre in Mumbai. <laughs> no jokes. We're putting everything we got into this on. Good man. Richie. What's the docking for the Wilson order? Oh, well, I don't know. Ask Kate. Oh, yeah. Good idea. I was worried he would notice we were two machinists down, but he's still talking about in the numbers. Will you calm down? Oh, I calm down. We are on the cusp of forging a serious relationship. Oh, we should be looking at expansion. Right? New staff, new machines. Uh, hey, what's your like, eh? <laughs> you all right? Yeah, fine. How'd it go? Yeah, I've got all the details and I can talk you through it as soon as you like. Oh, well, it's all right. I trust you. Uh, I'd still like you to look through the figures. OK, well, maybe later. I've just got to go into town, you know, dry cleaning and stuff to do. Are you sure you're all right? Yes, I'm fine. I've just got stuff to do. Yeah, I'm going to have a go at pricing up some new machines. Tracy, I'm on the way to the bank to get the money. When can we meet? Right. <laughs> well, whatever happens, we've still got to work together. Well, at least I hope we still work together. Have you spoken to Nick, then? No. I just thought, you know, he's your ex-husband. And he's already sold you 20%. He's a decent bloke. He's not going to play us off against each other. So, we wait and see. Mm. You're a good chef. And you're a good manager. Well, let's hope he makes a decision soon. <laughs> what was all that about? Uh, well, I couldn't raise that cash, so I thought maybe I could do a deal with Leanne. Make it easier for Nick, sell us half each. Leanne? No, no way! Why not? I'd still have my 20%. I'd be the senior partner. We'd both have to put less money in. It's the perfect solution. You don't know her. She has ruined more businesses than I've had hot dinners. Look, your dad trusts her. Nick trusts her. This is a good idea. You are the main man here. You deserve better than half shares. I agree. But right now, that's up to Nick. Look, I've told you. I've got a good feeling about this. You just have to put your trust in me. We may need a miracle. Oh, I've got Tuscan bean stew in the oven. Have you got it? Oh, just give me the money. Come on, hand it over. Tracy! It's all there. If I find it short, you know what'll happen. It's not short. Where did you get it? None of your business. I bet you never thought you'd sink this low, did you? You know what? I am counting the days. It makes me wonder how far I could have pushed you. You've got what you wanted. That's it. Uh, one more thing. When Robert ups his offer, you've got to make sure that Nick agrees to sell. 